Hey everyone, so this is my first catch slash mini guide for Alejandro for the first week that he is active. So if you would like some tips and tricks or just to see me catch my first, stick around. So in order to find Alejandro Magno, you're going to take the road that's right here to the northeast of your starting location. You're going to follow that all the way up to this trailhead. I don't really know how to pronounce that. I don't want to butcher it, but you can read it right there. Once you get to this trailhead, you go to this dock, and you're going to go all the way up here into this northeast corner. And he's going to be located in this general area, like right through here. I, I don't know if it's going to be exact, but this is where I caught him. He was swimming in this general area here. So, all right, so... Alejandro Magno, he was a bit more difficult than I expected because I was reading this, and if I'm not mistaken, he is a size 2 to a 4 aught, which I tried to use a 2 aught spinner so that I could use it for both the Norway Legendary and this one this week, and it did not go very well. So, According to this, it says that he takes a spoon, spinner, doe, leeches, popper, minnow, frog, crankbait, swimbait, jerkbait, or spinnerbait. In my experience, he would not bite a spinner. I threw it in front of his face, I could see him swimming around, I tried repeatedly, did not work. I switched to a popper, and because of his traits, it says that he will only bite something that's been twitched. So a popper kind of makes the most sense. And in my experience, I used a size 2 popper. So, I was using this rod. So I tried this spinner. It did not work at all. I threw it in front of his face. I threw it behind him. I threw it all around him. He ignored it completely. I ended up going to this popper. And this popper caught him on the first cast. So I would recommend if you're trying to catch him, just put a size 2 popper on, throw it out, and just be done with it. I don't even screw with the spinner. I, I don't know why, but for some reason with the spinner, he just had, wanted nothing to do with it. So toss a popper, twitch it, you're good to go. And yeah, we are down here. Uh, against the little mountain up at the top northeast corner and I can see him swimming around here this is after I'd failed with the spinner for probably an hour or more I this is immediately after I switched to the the size 2 popper so I don't know if a size 2 spinner would be better or if he just doesn't respond to spinners as well as he does like a, a twitching bait, like a topwater frog or popper. But, yeah, immediately after I the popper, I got a bite. So, I think from now on, he's up, I'm just going to try to catch a more popper. And, yeah, if you want to stick around and watch the rest of the catch, that would be great for my analytics. <laughs> but, otherwise, if you would like, if you like these videos, feel free to like, subscribe. Help me hit 100. I'm hoping to hit 100 subs by the end of the year. And, uh, yeah, it'd be really appreciated if you did. Anyway, you can stick around with the rest of the catch if you'd like. And if not, take care.